guys, Mick Jebel here, and I'm here with a review of Fantasia. And uh, Fantasia is a film that I've watched when I was very little. I hadn't remembered it very well, and now I watched it when I came older. And I still love the film. Now, I don't know if this can be called a film. Because there's no exact story. The way it goes is that they play music, you see little animations on it, and that's it. That's about it. It's eight songs. All classical music. So, naturally, you think it's... I don't know if I can exactly give it five out of five stars. I mean, the animation's amazing for 1940s technology. And it really does have some really great music that I enjoy. But ultimately, it doesn't have a lot more to it. I mean, it's very rewatchable. It's just, I don't know. It's not... It's the same thing that I said just a review ago about Forrest Gump. It just doesn't go that extra length for me. It's, but I still love it more regardless because it's still... It's a film that it touches me in my heart. Because... I watched it when I was very, very little, and, you know, that's all I gotta say about it. Um, I give it a four and a half out of five stars, uh, for the reason of the fact that it doesn't really have much to it, but still a great watch, uh, mm, I would recommend it for the great music and the great animation, which is the only two things really in it anyways. Uh, like, favorite, subscribe. Shares on Facebook and Twitter if you're an awesome person. And this is Mega Jet Boy out.